Spiken. And you are... Illyria Special Brigade Commander Ramlethal Valentine. Oh? I take it my name is on your list of potential insurgents. No. It's on my list of emergency consultants. You're not here by chance, are you? This girl seems to be lost. Delilah. That's all she told me. I assume it's her name. child why don't like kids i like them fine as long as they stay on the ground a kid's a kid don't you see what's going on with her she can't control her power her energy can't stop expanding all right spill it what are you planning to do please with her? stand back it's dangerous Answer me i'm the one who got here first now let me it doesn't matter who you are Incapacitation is her top priority now. Incapacitation? What the hell are you saying? She's just a kid, damn it! <sighs> Can you see the city down there? That kid is about to wipe out everything in a nine kilometer radius, including 120,000 people. <gasps> She's going to jump somewhere far away. The blast will destroy the city, even if it's not her intention. She still has the power to do so. She's as strong or stronger than she was back in the cradle. Somewhere far away, the White House. Careful. Thank you. Any backup? May Squad is on their way. Shouldn't we check in with the Capitol about this? There's no need. Four adults against one little girl. We can handle this. Stay calm. What's the worst that can happen? That sphere could rupture. It could be half a day, it could be a second. Then what? What happens after half a day or a second? Uh... Let the Capitol focus on the attack on the White House. This matter falls to us to handle. But there's no way we can evacuate all the civilians by ourselves. Our best chance may be to attack the girl directly. Wait! Batman!
with this. This is why I hate wearing armor. to you, huh? Sorry for the misunderstanding, but look at her! She's crying! We can't just abandon her! Help's on its way! Just believe! be fighting now? Brother. What do I do? I try to stop it, but... but it's way too much for me! A small girl, at the center of all that energy. How close to her can we get? Her sphere has multiple layers. The closer to the center, the deadlier. It's a super high density info space. It could grind an ordinary person to dust. We're already inside the outer perimeter anyway. Take us as far as we can go. Dr. Faust, please think of a way to rescue the girl. Status report. She's probably the one who knows most. <laughs> no strangers here, huh? Miss Biken? The city must be in a panic. Would an advisory reach them from here? It should, but what do we say? Say that anyone who flees the city will die. Huh? The city's not the backyard or the real world. And she's too immature to maintain the integrity of the field. Time is of the essence. Your government agents? Nah, just a bodyguard. Hers to be exact. I'm with intelligence. But I have no business with the White House at this point. So does she have anything to do with that terrorist attack? <sighs> Her name's Delilah. Our friend, trashing the White House right now, killed her brother. And now, she's out for revenge. Her brother? That must be Bedman. That walking bed frame from before? Huh, your stupidity's adorable, but I'm sure her brother was human. 
Bedman was human when he was alive. We don't know if that thing was really him or not, but between the energy sphere and his supposed attack, it checks out that she might be his sister. The question is, what does she want at the White House? I mean, she's after Bedman's killer, right? In that case, the person she's after is locked away under Illyria. Oh, Ariel's. The old Sanctus Maximus. Did you say Ariel's? Shit. I guess Sin wasn't messing with me. Speak. There's no time for riddles. Sometimes looks are deceiving, but sometimes you see what you get. The one Delilah's after was once inside Ariel's, and she's definitely not the first. I know, because he's my prey, too. He's that man. I know a thing or two about that man. Why do you think Delilah started following me around? Oh, come on. Just take her to the police and get it over with. If it's that easy, you go do it. Me? I'm busier than I look. Mirrors don't make themselves, you know? Mirrors now, too? Umbrellas aren't paying the rent these days. You better be right about that man. I'm not ready for you to cut me down. Are you really about to go all the way to America? I've wandered around for 20 years. What's one more trip? Now nothing else out of you. You're the only person who could ever talk me out of my revenge. By this time, you know my answer. I'm not the only one. Hmm? Check my mirror someday. You'll see. <laughs> Check my mirror. <laughs> Check yourself. Of the line. You're your own problem now. Where'd she go? Nope. I did my part. I liked you more when you were lost. Stop following me. Go away. One more step and I cut you down. What the hell am I doing? Delilah, was it? What are you, girl? I'm after the same person as you. To avenge my brother. Huh? Damn it, Archie. What'd you get me into? I asked Mr. Mito for help. When I told him my story, he sent me your way, Miss Biken. First rule? No miss. Then how about... Big Sis? Do you want me to cut you? So it's revenge you're after. I know I'm one to talk, but what do you get out of it? I think you know, Big Sis. The same thing as you. Do you know what goodbye means? It's a word that changes as you grow. I'm plenty grown already. I'm not. And I don't trust people who think they are. Listen, I know you don't want to hear this, but revenge is no game. You think everything's a game to me just because I'm 12? You'll waste your life. 
Is that what you want? <sighs> I won't if you'll teach me. I can help you. Look around. See the company you're in? I've always been alone. Have you ever dug through garbage for your next meal, girl? Do you know how scary it is to steal so much you feel the guilt melt away? If you want to stand on my level, you're gonna have to... Gonna have to... No. You shouldn't be like me. But why not? Breaking news! The unthinkable has happened! There is a gunfight underway on the White House premises! Who are these terrorists? What are they after? And how did so many of them make it through security? These details remain unclear. We're working with other news organizations to bring you the truth on this national crisis. Terrorists. It's him. The White House. Hey, where are you going? Mr. Ryu asking for help. I'll do this alone, too. Not happening. Why not? It's a long way to go to die. No one will visit your grave. Nobody would anyway. My brother was the only family I had. And in terms of sheer power, I'm stronger than he was. Victory's not everything. You've got a whole lot more to learn about the world, girl. But why? <sighs> you won't give up on your revenge no matter what anyone says. Am I wrong? That's something we've got in common. So even if you won't listen to anyone else, Here's hoping you'll hear me out. Let me handle this. You need something better than this shitty life. But why? We need all the decent adults we can get. But why? <sighs> Talk about a problem, child. Tell me why! I know. You'll think I'll mess it up because I'm a child. Or do you just not want me stealing your prize? I don't want to get in your way or take anything from you. So why? Why can't we just kill him together? Together? Don't you see I'm trying to kill someone? How could I possibly grow up to be a decent adult if I want someone dead so badly? That's over my head, but you want to save Delilah, right? Save her. What else are you here for? <laughs> you know, if you'd stick with her, she might just give this whole revenge thing up. Big talk, but it's not that simple. <sighs> Never said it was. Between us and the 120 grand people down there, there's one person who can handle this. You. <sighs> Astute diagnosis. If we can get the girl's emotional state under control, that may solve this. If you want to avenge your kid, I'm sure my old man and my father can take care of that. Hmm? Huh? I don't even know where the hell to begin with that. For starters, I don't have a kid. Oh, so what's with the eye patch then? You're just full of questions. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> gotcha, gotcha. Say no more. Mom always said it's not really a story for kids. But I'm five years old already. I know where babies come from. They pop out of your eye, right? Um, care to elaborate? I mean, what else is there to tell? One day, one of Mom's eyes fell out, so Dad got all freaked out and gave her one of his. Thing is, it didn't fit so well. It fell right back out, and Mom got better on her own. A bit of this, a bit of that, and both of them were healed. 
Later, Dad's eye, the one that fell on the ground, turned into me. Oh, did it hurt? You're in for a shock when you learn the whole story. Really? I don't know. I'm pretty hard to shock. Anyway... Sin, I almost forgot. You're half gear. You've got less to lose than the rest of us, and yet... I wish I were half as tough as you are deep down. Not very fair, is it? How is her situation any different from ours? Well, I had Johnny. And so did you. The whole crew did. Viking didn't get so lucky. You think there's... Anything we could say that'd... Fix that in a flash? Out. I'll explain while we work. Miss May, kindly gather all the winches and wire you can spare. Okay, are we hauling something huge? What kind of load are we talking about? Perhaps ask what your senses tell you. So we're winging it? Mr. Sin, contact Dr. Paradigm. Follow this note to the letter, please. Roger that! Lastly, Miss Ramlethal. I'll need you to absorb the girl's energy as thoroughly as you can, please. Unfortunately, this is not a problem with a definite solution. Your capacity will determine the outcome. In other words, please remain focused. What's your point? Whatever may happen, you must be prepared to abandon me. This comes down to endurance. I'm putting everything on the line to save that girl. Do you know her? No. But I still have an interest in her salvation. I'm not some tool here to help you atone. What? Wh why would you... I apologize in advance. Because I won't be able to if this mission fails. I'll take any help you can offer. Stop! Get away from me! I... I can't control it! Miss Ramlethal, why did you summon me, exactly? Because you're an expert in the field of applied magic. I don't recall that. It was ages ago. Yes, I'm aware of your past. That's why I knew you'd help us, even if it cost your life. I did take an oath. Tell me, Doctor. 
Do you wish to save that girl? Or to die a hero? Nobody I've called here understands self-preservation. Not one of them will abandon another. I'm not meant to leave now. That's why I need their help. And yours. Promise me that you'll do everything you can to protect her. And yourself. If you want to save Delilah, I need to believe in you. It seems that I'm the one who must prepare. Back to square one. now you know you actually make a great commander working in intelligence you learn to really listen to people you may not be human but you believe in us more than I do going faster Stay here. Ah! 
are you doing? It's too late. Doctor, what happens if the teleportation starts before it's all inside? <sighs> no. I won't give up. Square one. Square one. for the wait! You okay, Tiny? I will be. After I eat and pass out for a bit. <laughs> Is Delilah gonna be okay? Whatever that means. Whether she gets her revenge or not, it won't make a difference. She won't die well. Unless she finds a better way to live. Wait a sec. Who have I heard say that before? Right! Anji! He was talking about you. Huh. What's that? The Lila's teleportation won't be stopped. So the commander's going with her to keep her safe. The data's already compressing. Who are you? Stay calm. The city will be okay. My team has it under control. You see what's happening, don't you? You're about to be sent somewhere else. <gasps> don't worry. I'll keep you safe. Somewhere else? Where? The commander's absorbing the sphere's energy, but it's too much. If the girl doesn't quit panicking, it could get planet-sized. All we can do is believe in her. Believe. All your faith. Is strong enough for salvation.
It's okay. You'll be fine. Hey, Delilah. You're a pain in my ass, you know that? Get out of here, no! You can't handle this information density! Ah, good point. Thanks. So you're the one. We're going. Huh? We're going. Together. And we'll stay together night and day. We'll eat and we'll laugh together. And our revenge? Let's give it up. Together. Here? It is! It's a gear! The gear saved us all! 